Yes. Right. That's uh, where we are right now, Bartonville, Bellevue areas. There's the city of Peoria. We have the new warning, and that warning goes uh, quite a ways away. Why don't we zoom out just a little bit, Brian, and take a look at that new warning because uh, it goes all the way to uh, Metamora, Eureka, Deer Creek, Washington, you're in the tornado warned area. This is coming right over the metro area, and we'll uh, we'll keep an eye. As long as it's radar indicated, uh, I think we might uh, stay put. But if there's any indication we get uh, a lowering of any type of uh, a cloud out there, uh, we will take cover on the air as well, like uh, the, well, they did. Uh, the weather team did on uh, Friday night. So we'll be uh, looking at that. But uh, we're we're seeing this on just about metro Peoria. Washington, East Peoria, Robin, Sunnyland, uh, we're talking Beverly Manor, we're talking uh, just about to Eureka, Metamora, you're in it, and uh, Deer Creek is in it, uh, Groveland is in it, Pekin is in it, and we have uh, several different tornado warned storms here, but the biggest one has been issued all the way up now into Woodford County uh, from the action we're seeing in western Peoria County around Norwood and uh, Peoria and into uh, the southwestern sections of the viewing area around Glassford. So that's what we're continuing to see here tonight. Um, so uh, the uh, situation is Metro Peoria take cover, Washington, East Peoria, all of Metro Peoria take cover because uh, uh, this is a uh, potentially uh, dangerous situation with a tornado. And uh, we've uh, had the tornado on the ground in uh, Fulton County uh, that's caused some damage. Right now, this one is still radar indicated, but it could drop at any time, so we'll keep you posted on that. Once again, we're watching it here at studios as well because uh, we'll take cover if there is a tornado threat directly to our building because uh, uh, we don't uh, uh, we don't want to be uh, martyrs. We're not going to. We want to keep you. Uh, uh, safe, but we want to keep safe as well. So, Brian, this thing has turned into a just a big monster in the past couple of hours. Yes, yeah, so here's your rotation again. We're still watching this. Uh, probably have another velocity scan coming in here in the next minute or two. But uh, kind of approaching Creve Core, um, you see the red green couplet still just to the south of Creve Core. There's your new scan coming in. So, uh, this is almost due north of Pekin. Your red green uh, just to the southwest of Creve Core. Um, it may be a little bit southeast of the Peoria Airport, and, uh, and we're, we're just east of Route 24, very close to 474 as well. So we'll watch those areas in Peoria Metro, especially uh, maybe the southern part of the city, Creve Core, East Peoria. Uh, these are areas that I believe I hear that are those the sirens? Yeah, the sirens truck? are going okay. off around here. Yeah. Yeah. So the, at the moment, still radar indicated. If we look out, uh, Emily, let's take our camera again. Um, we'll be watching this carefully as this storm, maybe I want to try and move this here a little bit if we can off to the, we'll try and look a little bit into the storm if we can. I don't know if you can hear, those are the sirens going off here in East Peoria. Okay. Yeah, let's take that while this loads. Well, uh, so this is a levee district in East Peoria. 